Hi there guys, welcome to Bluehost Training Part 2. Well, in this particular video, I'm going to share with you guys how exactly to create a customized email address with the domain that you have just purchased. Alright, now first and foremost, when we talk about email addresses, a lot of people make a mistake by clicking on this email and office. It is not here, but rather, can go. Um, you can go under this advanced tab on the left, click on it. Now then over here, you will see all these email accounts, forwarders, you know, it looks very daunting. You know, honestly, when I first saw it, I was like, what the hell are all these? So don't worry about all this, just go straight into email accounts. Okay, now pretty simple. You will see this create icon over here on the right, which is in blue, so click on that. Now over here, because you have only one domain, so automatically it will populate the domain name for you but if you have a few domains like what i have if you click on the downwards arrow button you see all these different domains right so i will choose this particular one now the username will be over here so for example i might want to put um help you know at say by 925.com so this will be my customized email address okay then key in the password of your choice right <clears throat> and from there click the create button <coughs> all right so now if you were to scroll down you will see this particular email that's already been created over here which is help at say by 95.com if you want to check any emails just go into check email here click on it On the left, you see this open button. Click on it again. So usually when you create a customized email address using Bluehost, it's under this software called Roundcube. Okay. Now don't worry about this particular software. It's just a normal interface for you to receive and send emails. So the very first email will be sent by Bluehost, which is the client configuration settings. So if you double click on it, we'll open up the entire email. And these are all the settings that you would actually need to save, you know, because sometimes you might actually need to integrate your email with other kind of softwares online. Like for example, you might actually want to warm up this particular email address. So you need a username, you need a um, host name as well, or they call it a host address or host username, whatever it is. Then you also have the IMAP port, you know, and as well as SMTP port number. Okay, so this is, the, Generally, is IMAP port will be 993, SMTP port will be 465. Now, <clears throat> SMTP refers to the outgoing server, right? Because whenever you send an email, of course, you need a server to help you to send it to your designated destination. All right, so this is for outgoing. IMAP is actually for incoming. <clears throat> so same thing, when people send an email to you, this is where the server actually process that email and enters into your respective email inbox. Okay, so this is a very short lecture on how exactly to create a customized email address using Bluehost. I hope you find this video useful and I will be having more videos uploaded when it comes to how to actually use Bluehost, optimize your online business. Okay, so if you find this video useful, now what I said, please remember to click the like button and subscribe to the video for further updates. Take care.